Here are three multiple choice questions. Question 16. Solve for x, 6 to the power of x plus 3 minus 6 to the power of x equals to 2, 1, 5. So you have four choices, minus 1, 1, 0, and 6. So I'll prefer you solve it than then make a choice. Question 17. If y equals 2, 3 to the power of x, then log 3 equals to x, or log x equals to 3, or x equals to 3 to the power of y, or x equals to log y over log 3. So these are your options. Question 18. Which of the following statement is correct? Log 3 of 2 equals to minus log 2 of 3, or log 3 of 2 equals to 1 minus log 2 of 3. Log 3 of 2 times log 2 of 3 equals to log 3 of 2 plus log 2 of 3. Or log 3 of 2 times log 2 of 3 equals to 1. So these are your choices. So make your choice and then look into my solution. Question 16. You can always solve this, right? So you can take 6 to the power of x common and then figure it out. But in a multiple choice question, I prefer, you can plug it and check. You know, it takes less time with calculators. If calculators allowed, that's very simple. Even otherwise for these values. So if I plug in, for example, 1 here, it is 6, right? And 1 will give me 6 to the power of 3, which is 6 times 6 times 6, right? So we get what is 6 to the power of 3? So 6 times 6 times 6 is equal to 216. Correct? So 6 to the power of 3 is equal to 216, right? And we need 215, so it is, of course, 6 to the power of 3, 1 less. So 0 is a good option, correct? Because if I write 0, you get 6 to the power of 3 here, minus 6 to the power of 0 is 1, minus 6 to the power of 0, which is 1, will give us 215, right? So that gives us the answer straight away. Good. So, so that's like, that is fastest way of doing it. Now, question 17. If y equals to 3 to the power of x, then, then out of these options, what should be right? So what we should do, or what we normally do? These are all to the base 10, you see. They are not to the base 3, right? So if you do to the base 10, then what will it become? So we get log of y equals to x times log of 3, right? And if you have to find x from here, then x is equals to log of y divided by log of 3. That means option D is correct. Okay? Now, question 18. Which of the following statement is correct? Log 3 of 2 is not equal to this. Log 3 of 2 is equal to 1 over log 2 of 3, correct? Not minus, correct? So that's wrong. Log 3 of 2 is 1 minus. No, that also doesn't work. Log 3 of 2 times log 2 of 3 is equal to this plus this. That is wrong. So you have to have same basis, then you multiply 2 and 3, right? Log, log 3 of 2 times log 2 of 3 is 1. Now, yeah, that is correct, because if you write log 3 of 2 equals to 1 over log 2 of 3, then when you cross multiply, then you get this equals to 1. So that becomes the right choice, correct? So D is correct for that. I hope you understand. These are kind of tricky and good questions to practice. Thank you.